Hi, welcome to the Make a Game tutorial. So, I've already been editing a level. We've got some terrain, some buildings down, and uh, some trees and foliage. And we're going to start by placing a start marker down in this pathway here. And we're going to put in some weapons. So, I'm going to use the Colt. And if I scroll down, move across this building here, we've got some crates and things. So place my Colt onto the weapon. We also want some ammo. It's quite small, so we can actually zoom down, lower down, and see that. Finally tune our design. Okay, so the player will walk through here, pick up these weapons. Why would he need those weapons? Okay, well, we've got a bit of a base here, and I'm going to place down an enemy character. We've got a character's uh, combat soldier. This guy is designed to patrol and look after his area. There he is. And you can see these barrels here. These are explosive barrels. So if we're clever, we should shoot those. And because these boxes behind are dynamic, they'll fly into the air when these explode. Uh, anything static wouldn't move around. So for example, this uh, pallet here, that will stay exactly where it is. All right. And that's going to be quite easy to shoot and uh, take him out. So I'm going to also add a rocket man, and he's going to guard the exit to the path here. And we get within a certain range of him, he'll be starting to fire at us. And at the very end, I'm going to place down what's called a wind zone. And this will trigger the end of the particular level. And Game Guru allows you to string levels together. So you walk into this as the player, and then the next level would load. OK, so there's our game. Let's launch it and see the action. OK. Here we go. They've not detected us yet. We'll creep over here, pick up our Colt, all our ammo. When he sees me, start shooting at me. If I shoot these barrels, I took him out. So I'm a bit hurt, so the likelihood is Rocky Man, ooh, shot too high there. I'll let him re rearm, take me out. I've got another life. I can reload by pressing R. See if I can take him out before he takes me out. There we go. And I can pick his weapon up. Have a bit of fun with this. I picked up the ammo of the dead guy as well. Yeah. So I'm out of uh, rockets now. I'll just walk to the end. And we can see at the bottom it says level complete triggered. So, in a standalone game, that would then move on to the next level. Press Escape, come back to the editor, and I can start adding more and more to our game. So, that's the basics of building a game, and uh, yeah, that's simple.